for this trick we need spectator to choose any card from the deck and sign it so let's say in this case we will use already signed card with my name which is three of hearts now we will take the signed card and return it somewhere inside the packet like this and we will simply cut the deck to make sure it is lost and furthermore we will shuffle the deck like this once we are happy shuffling all i have to do is just snap my fingers like this and believe or not the card traveled from the deck directly into my wallet that i have on a table i feel that you don't trust me much so there is nothing easier than check on our own eyes and we can see that we have really one card inside the wallet that is locked and we will just take out the card and look what card it is three of hearts your signed card this is definitely one of the easiest methods i know how to appear signed card in your wallet but it will still require few things from you first of all it is a double back card that you can buy or you can make it by sticking two cards together second thing is to know how to control a card to the top of the deck and the third thing is to know how to do a double lift there are already many great tutorials on the youtube on how to do all these moves so we will not spend much time on it but for a case that you are a real total beginner we will just run through it very quickly first thing we need to know is how to control a card so in the performance i used very easy method so let's say we have this card again and we want to return it into the packet and control to top so i pushed it inside the deck and now i applied pressure with my thumb from the top like this and inserted the card fully inside the packet and you see that i have now break between the card and the rest of the deck now i simply transfer this break from thumb to my pinky so like this so again i have a break above the selected card now i simply cut the deck two times like this and now i have my card controlled to top there are many controls out there you just need to search the youtube this is one of the easiest methods second move we need to know is the double lift so let's imagine we have this card placed on top and one more card above it so normally we would turn over just one card like this it would be the king but when we are doing double lift we will turn over two cards as one so you can see that we now displayed the second card how to do it it is uh, really simple but it will require some practice so you have your setup and now you will take your cards and you have to have it in slight angle like this now you will apply pressure with your thumb somewhere around the center and uh, with this finger you will just come from the side and feel when you have two cards and then you will turn them over like one as i mentioned we will not go through details now because there are already many tutorials on the youtube and there are also more ways how to do the double lift so you can find your way how to do it now we know everything to perform the trick so take your double back card and place it somewhere inside your wallet i have it for example here now take the deck and let the spectator choose any card and sign it we will again use same card that is signed with my name it is three of hearts so once it is signed just return it somewhere inside the packet and control it to top now you know how to do it in performance i did also a shuffle so i will quickly show you that i peeled off the first card like this and shuffled rest of the deck on it so now i have the selection on the bottom and then i shuffled again and i just made sure that the selection is the last card i shuffle so i have it again on top 
Now uh, take your wallet, show to spectator that there is one card inside, take it out and now place it on the top of the deck. Now the last thing is to perform the double lift. So again, now you know how to do it. So let's turn over two cards as one. And now you can show to spectator that it was his card that was inside your wallet. So this was the trick. I hope you liked it. If yes, please give thumbs up. Thank you for attention. See you next time.